So I'm at the Hedgehog, comic number 133, after story, Mobius 25 years later. For today's social studies lesson class, we will learn about Angel Island as our example. Angel Island has existed in its present form for over half of a millennia. Probably seems in ancient history to our people, and actually just a blip in the entire existence of Mobius. Until recently, it had one city, Echidnopolis, and it has been composed of a number of ecosystems referring to as zones. During the past 20 years, 20 years. However, it seems extraordinary in the development of a self-contained biosphere. At the same, Kinopolis evolved into an essential chair for a government for Echidnas everywhere, and has come to be recognized as the oldest democracy in the Mobius. Yes, Regine. If we're a democracy, how come the world map says it's a republic of Angel Island? That's a good question. Anyone have an answer, class? Jacob? Because the Akinas didn't believe in a monarchy, unlike the backwards culture of Mobius. Oh, not quite. Anyone else in their suit? Because the citizens elected their representatives to make laws and decisions. Very good! What about the Guardian, Mr. Periwinkle? Who elected him? Ah, the Guardian. Now, he is accorded to be a special status in, a, in, your, in our society, Bhutan. Special as in what? You mean we're going to have to bow, someday bow down to little Miss Sunshine here? You bitch! Ow! Larry Sue, this is not how a young lady conduct themselves. Especially the daughter of a guardian. I will see you after class. Tell Sonic and Sally next party will be fine. Will they bring their children? And? He said, of course, and added Sonia and Manic were especially excited to see Larry Sue again. <sighs> Is that a problem? Julie Sue mentioned something about a boy having a crush on Larry Sue. You plan on doing some royal matchmaking? Hardly. Maybe I should tell Bonita. She'd love to do the prince. At least they're closer in age. Besides, you approve of her dating at her age. Bite your tongue, Nux. Anything else? Well, Ruger wasn't for company, but but Spectre was also he here to see Kobar. That's not surprising, given their history. Wonder what they're up to this time. Pretty scary when two mad scientists get together, considering their last project. Well, yeah, well... Keep an eye on them for now. I'll check in with Kobar later. Will do. Is that all? I guess. I have to come, I have to get home for Lara Susan Wheeling ceremony tonight. So I'll check back with you later. Over and out. Clink. So are you going, Linda? After all, they are family. You don't need reminding grandfather. But it's not like Julie Sue and I have been on the best of terms. Now would be a good time as to say the men some fences. Hello, Ruton. Ancestor. Uh. Ruton, what happened to your head? Please, Mother. It's nothing. Leave it alone. Did you get in a fight? No. Don't recall Craig Ock or I behaving so. Neither of you were parental. But you were both treacherous. Hello? Anyone home? Up here! What's going on? Where's Lara Sue? She's in there. So, I can appreciate the need for privacy. She doesn't want to come out. For some reason, she doesn't want to go through with the unveiling. Come out of there! At once, Lara Sue! Go away! Afraid I can't do that. I won't go! You come out of there now! No! Calm down, hon. Try to reason with her. Reason? With a 16-year-old teenager? Where's the book on that one? Well, screaming sure isn't going to solve anything. Lara Sue, all the Akina girls are, are unveiling when they turn 16. It's one of those things you must do. I want to be a guardian. Out of the question. But why? You were much younger than I was when you became a guardian. Let's not go there. Then why? I have my reasons. Such as? For one thing, what do you need a 
guardian for when others are essentially carrying out on the same function. Things are different now. I wanna be a guardian! <sighs> you know, there's another ancient echidna custom I think needs reviving. It's called spanking! Knuckles, how about barbaric? I give up. You try reasoning with her. No! You know what the problem is, so you reason with her! <sighs> Lara Sue, I know you want to be a guardian. And I think you'd be, you'd make a great guardian. It's just that I don't believe there's a need for one anymore. Myself included. Not going to the unveiling tonight won't affect anything other than you missing out on an important event in your life. Lara Sue. All right, Daddy. I'll go. As long as you promise to, to pro, if you, as long as you promise me the first dance.